Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Abel Freak, and today we will test speed test of these two devices. On the left side we have Samsung Galaxy S21 5G variant, Exynos one, and one on the right side is Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra, again 5G variant, and Exynos one. So let's quickly see that everything is closed in the background and we can just turn them off and after that we will turn them on and we will see which one of them you know is faster at boot up guys if you and if you're new to the channel sub will be really amazing because you are the only one who can help me out to reach that well your 13k goal and by the way so right now let's quickly turn them on at the same time three two one go and see which one of these two devices is faster, you know. You need to click on some of these two devices. Because there is a lot of flickering. When I focus here, there is a lot of flickering. Let me see. No, now is great. Let's see which one is faster at boot up. and Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. S21 Plus is just a little bit slower there. So guys, let's go right now and start with phone data. Pretty much the same messages, same. Let's go with YouTube, S20 Ultra, let's go with the settings, same here, we have, we have Play Store, pretty same, pretty same I would say, let's go with Facebook, S20, S21 Plus this time, let's go with WhatsApp, same, we have Viber, same really let's go with wish pretty same pretty same let's go back to home screen snapchat same but a little bit faster on this s21 plus let's go with jetpack joyride first game of this test which one is faster what do you think and uh slightly faster this newer s21 plus let's go back we have Asphalt 9 Legends right now. And the faster one is, what I think again, S20 Ultra, you know. Pretty great, pretty great. Now let's go right now with this Angry Birds 2. S21 Plus, faster right now. And yeah, it is faster. Just a little bit, you know. Let's go back to home screen. Temple Run 2. S20 plus, 21 plus. A little bit faster, nothing too crazy. Let's go with this speed test by Okla. And right now, we will test them at the same time. Okay, S20 Ultra starting to winning this without any problems. And we have that better download speed and upload speed. Pretty close, pretty close. Equal, really. No, S S20 Ultra is better. And let's go right now to home screen. We have to open this uh, Zedge. 
I didn't click that on S20 Pog, let's walk. So we will reopen this. Three, two, one, go. S20 Ultra was faster here, and we have color switch right now. Last game, S20 Ultra. Let's right now go to this 3D Mark test, and we need to, uh, you know, allow everything, skip this, download this, you know, kind of wild life, you know, uh, benchmark test, so we can see the average frame rate of this two device here, you know, because we need to uh, see which one of them will be pretty much better, you know, for gaming, and we need to wait. So guys, of course, if you're new to the channel, sub will be really amazing because you are the only one who can help me out to reach that 13k goal and after that we can you go for 14 and one day for 100k, which is a really great deal, you know, for me. Let's start this test right now at the same time and they are both Exynos, one on the left side is, uh, you know, uh, Samsung Galaxy S21 Plus. 5G variant and one on the right side is Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra also 5G variant and they are both Exynos so I'm really you know glad to have uh, Exynos right now so I can test the global ver version of this device but if you ask me like tru truly what I want to test that's a triple eight Snapdragon you know 888 because for me, it's just a better, you know, phone with, with that, you know, Snapdragon processor inside of it. But still, most of you guys will get this Exynos 2100, which is pretty damn good, you know, processor. But I will say still, Snapdragon is just a little bit better. But this year, it's starting to see, you know, some difference between them, you know. Uh, more or less, uh, like less difference between them. The last year was a really big difference between Snapdragon and Exynos, and this year it's a little bit better. Let me just set up this here, and you can see, guys, the results of this two device 33 FPS of average on this S21, S21 Plus 5G Exynos, and there is 25.6 on this S20 Ultra 5G, also Exynos 1. So guys, that's pretty much it. If you're new to the channel, sub will be really amazing because you're the only one who can help me out to reach that 13k goal. We will see you in the next one. Peace.